morning everyone welcome back to my channel my name is renee if you're new welcome to a week in my life new york city style if you guys are new here i am from florida i moved to new york in march perfect timing i know it is so freezing outside already it's like 50 something degrees which is a lot for a floridian and it's super rainy and gloomy so i think today what i'm gonna do is just kind of keep it as inside as possible but my goal this week is to get out do things and just explore the city a little bit cautiously obviously we woke up this morning like i said it's it's a super gloomy day so we went to go get some juices at the local market here i've been like really into juices i have a friend that i recently met who actually lives in my building which is really exciting but she's like a big tiktok person <laughs> she's big on tiktok she does like law of attraction inspirational stuff her name is Haley hoffman we went out to go for a walk last week and i got a juice which i'm more a smoothie person and i've been actually really liking it i got one called the green monster and it has apple celery spinach and lemon it's very refreshing i'm trying to introduce noah to it but he got like some carrot one and it's really gross to be honest and he's like drinking it he's like oh my god today's video is actually going to be sponsored by elf cosmetics you guys have probably heard of them before especially if you watch my channel i love them they're a great affordable beauty and makeup line they have everything from like makeup makeup tools, skincare, they have it all. And it's literally insane the prices and how affordable their products are and the quality of their brand. They're 100% vegan and guilt-free. So you don't have to worry about any of that nonsense. And in my opinion, they compete with like the top most expensive brands. Like they just are a great option for anyone who doesn't want to spend too much money on products and want to try a little bit of everything. So I picked up their new e.l.f. Retro Paradise line. This is really cool. It's like very shimmery, glam, retro. I'm just vibing with all the colors. I love like vintage retro stuff. So this is totally up my alley. This is something that came with it that I was like, oh look, it's like a cool little tool. But then I found out that this is actually like a massage technique kind of thing it's called a gua sha facial acupuncture massage tool i don't know if they just put this in there or if they sell it if they sell it i'll link it down below but you actually can use it to massage like specific parts of your body and noah and i sat there for like hours and massaged with this and i have tmj and this helps so much there's like a little indentation to where like you can massage like your jaw and like any tension area that you have like on your neck and stuff there's like videos on youtube you can search but just try this out this is really really cool this is actually believe it or not my favorite part of the whole entire thing so hopefully they sell it so i think a theme of this line is like shimmer glow shine and just like a dewy look which again if you guys know me you know i love this is their elf retro paradise primer glow oil you're supposed to dab like two or three drops on this before your foundation or you can add it into your foundation to make it look like super glowy and it just gives your skin that very youthful look um because it gives it a nice shine which we tend to lose with age and other factors like pollution in the air, sun damage, acne, whatever the case is. So this gives your skin a very nice tint and glow. This is the Bite Size Face Duo Spiced Apple. So it's a go-to cheek glow with highlighter and blush. I'm telling you guys like the prices of these are insane. The Retro Paradise Glow was 10 bucks. This, literally $3. Like, what the hell? Love a good deal. This is the highlighter, so I'm just gonna use my finger, honestly, and glide that, oh yeah. Look at that shine. I probably should have put the blush on first. <laughs> so this is the blush, and I like to put it like here up on my nose, because I feel like blush should be like wherever the sun hits you. Like you've been in the sun or you just, I don't know worked outside and you have that nice little rosy tint really liking that and then i'll put the highlighter on top of that and like look at the pigmentation too so just because it's three dollars doesn't mean it's not like the quality product i barely even swept it and i got all that pigmentation i'm gonna put a little bit on my eyelids look at that this is the liquid glitter eyeshadow almost looks like a lipstick applicator but it's for your eye which i find very unique and interesting they have this this is the pumpkin pie um eyeshadow palette this is like the perfect colors for fall time in my opinion and then they have the retro paradise eyeshadow palette which is really cool because they have like some really nice neutral tones but they also have really cool like bright 
colors which i feel like are really in right now first of all because it's halloween everyone wants like really cool eyeshadow palettes right now but also if you guys have seen euphoria and the makeup in that show i feel like kind of just sparked a lot of inspiration and simplicity but also very bright colors in terms of makeup so i feel like you could play around with these colors that's another thing with elf if you're like into bold makeup they have that if you're into like everyday neutral makeup like i they have a little bit for everyone so i'm gonna go in with the light one here and then just put that on the top of my eyelid i'm gonna use my mirror over here just simple and the pigment again so pigmented for three dollars it's like literally a no-brainer and then i'm gonna take the darker one and kind of go on my crease to kind of give my eyes some definition i always go in with the shimmer and there's two shimmers here so i'm gonna do more of the orangey one just because i'm wearing kind of like a fall style clothing item right now look at that three bucks three freaking bucks it's crazy i'm like genuinely shocked at these colors i feel like if you apply too with your fingers the like heat of your fingers kind of goes in with the makeup and applies it so dewy let me go throw on some mascara real quick and then i'll show you guys like a really cool thing that i'm so excited about i do love me some nice glossy lips this one is the dream on lip gloss oh my god the smell it smells like apple yum such a nice glowy dewy look i look so youthful so now this is really exciting let me take off my top it's getting real raunchy up in here hold on all right this is where it gets fun typically body glows are extremely expensive this is 12 bucks this brush is so soft i love this and then i'm basically just gonna brush that on my chest area oh my god it smells like apple i love the smell of this you just simply glide that everywhere adds such a nice glow literally obsessed especially here on your collarbones look at that look at that glow all right <laughs> So if you guys are interested, um, I will pop all their information down below. So definitely check them out. Huge shout out to them for sponsoring today's video. like ugh, so much better everything is just perfectly in order this drawer is denim this is uh sweatshirts i have so many that i literally can't even open it this is pj sets so these are huge giant t-shirts and then these are pj sets and then the bottom here are um sweats like leggings sweatpants that i'm wearing right now probably are gonna go in there um sweat shorts and just random stuff like that nice and organized I just got ready. I'm actually going out to dinner tonight. I'm going with my friend Haley. My friend Brooke introduced me to her and we actually live in the same building. No and I had like this ongoing joke about this girl who watched Gilmore Girls every night downstairs. And then my friend Brooke was like, oh, I think that you would like this girl. She's like super into the law of attraction and really sweet. She lives in your building. We were at dinner. <laughs> It's so embarrassing. She was like telling me how she watches Gilmore Girls all the time. And I was like, oh my God, so do I. And she's one floor below me. And I just like looked at her and I was like, well, let me tell you something. And like, we kind of bonded over that. But yeah, I like knew her before I actually knew her. So I'm going to introduce her to my friend Taylor, who I grew up with. You guys know Taylor. So I'm going to dinner with them. We're going to a place called Le Preve. It's a French restaurant. Um, I've been there before and they gave us free drinks, so it's a really cool spot. You guys should definitely check them out. It is freezing. It's still pouring rain outside, so I'm wearing just this simple turtleneck um, oversized sleeve shirt. I'm like obsessed with the color. It's like a charcoal gray. And then I'm wearing these pants. They're just like jeans uh, material uh, from Free People. And then I'm going to wear my Nasty Girl boots, which I don't have on right now. I hate wearing shoes in the house, <laughs> so... 
Uh, yeah, and then I have these earrings on that I'm pretty sure I got from Princess Polly. They're like these like hoops with little pearls here and then some just stacking rings. I ended up painting my nails uh, myself. I will pop the color here. I forgot what it was, but I put it on my Instagram story. It's from Olive and June. They have amazing like super fall aesthetic colors. Um, and I think it really matches well with this charcoal gray. I'm like actually really liking it. So yeah. That's where I'm headed. Monday night, got plans. Who the hell is she? All right, guys, I am officially back home. I am exhausted. <laughs> I had a little bit to drink. We're so stupid. We're like putting on our flashlights and we're like waving hi to each other through our windows. It was so funny and so cute. It's just insane how somebody that can open up so much to you or help you so much through like a time in your life can be like literally right downstairs. She's like right down there. Insane. I'm just so thankful that I'm meeting like such positive inspirational people anyway i'm in bed now i'm so tired i don't know i'm really happy which is honestly a crazy thing during this year and during this time period in my life i'm just like very happy i feel like girls night hit the spot you know probably gonna delete all this footage but it is 11 o'clock i'm tired i'm gonna go to bed i'm gonna read a few chapters of this book and go to bed Oh, I'm so tired, oh my god. It is currently Tuesday. I had so much fun last night. Just really good people and girl chats and talking and it was just, it was so much needed. Today is gonna be a really, really busy day for me. I have to get a video up by Wednesday and I don't have one. So I'm gonna be filming a favorites video today and I'm also gonna be editing, which is gonna be like an 11 hour kind of thing, but I'm not complaining. I really like work days like this, but I'm probably just not gonna be picking up the camera too much. I also have a therapy appointment in like 20 minutes, so that'll be really nice. It is raining again, so perfect day for filming and staying inside. It's just so cozy, so comfortable. We got the heater going on. Last night, we ended up throwing on this weighted blanket that I had in my closet. I had this blanket on, threw on this one, he also had this one, so we're just like huddled up in all these blankets. We're not used to it, but it's 58 degrees. Crazy. I'm chilly, but um, yeah, that's just kind of a rundown of my day. I'm probably not gonna pick up the camera, like I said, just because I'm gonna be like in work mode, but that's what we have going on today. Noah made really yummy shrimp with veggies and banana peppers. Uh, he made really good uh, pasta. This is the banza pasta. And of course, this is what I made. The burnt vegetables, my one job. Guys, look how cool this looks at night. You can see like the clouds. Let me turn the brightness down. Look at that. Looks crazy cool. It looks like mountains, but those are clouds. This is a really beautiful time of the day. I just finished working. I'm whispering because Noah's watching a show, but I just finished my favorites video. I've been working all day. It's 8.30. I'm exhausted. Um, we're gonna go to the museum tomorrow, the Natural Museum of History. So I need to like get some sleep because I feel like tomorrow's gonna be a really busy day too. It'll be fun. It won't be like work busy, but I'm so excited, so yeah.
it is currently Thursday. Yesterday was so much fun. We went to Central Park, we went to the museum. Highly recommend if you guys are in the New York City area or if you guys are just visiting, beyond incredible. And the T-Rex exhibition was crazy. The evolution of humans, that was a really, really, really cool exhibition. Um, I'm a huge fan of Sapiens. That book was just so incredible to me. So like seeing all of like the skulls in person was beyond. It was really cool. It was just a beautiful day. We ended up walking like over 18,000 steps. So when I got home, I like zonked out. I was so tired. Um, this morning, I've been just working on editing this vlog, actually. We're going to paint the wall today. I got my paint last week. I don't know the exact color of it, but I will pop it here on the screen for you guys if you are interested. I'm going to be painting this wall like a very dark blue color. And I feel like it'll like totally go well with a dark um, like homey feels. I'm a very masculine person in terms of my decor. I, I like dark colors. I feel like they're just super cozy and warm. So I'm really excited to see how this turns out. slowly but surely progressing we got like the whole walls first coat um, we're doing pretty well on the sides here but we messed up I don't know if you guys can tell we pretty much messed up real bad on the top but there's gonna be a painter here tomorrow so he I'm gonna call him and see if he can help fix it but for right now we're just gonna leave the top as is and then do a second coat of paint probably tomorrow and just leave the bedding and stuff like that um like this for right now i'm actually going to a dinner tonight again i have all these plans all of a sudden uh so i have to pop in the shower and get ready i have like 45 minutes so love that It's currently Friday and I've just been sitting on my computer editing this vlog. Last night was so much fun. We ended up going to Cathedral, which is just like a really great restaurant. If you guys have heard of Tao, they are the same like company. It's just amazing. You have to go like underneath the ground to even get in the restaurant and it's just a stunning place. Like literally one of my favorite places, probably my favorite place that I've ever been in New York so far. But I'm just sitting here in my robe. It's like rainy and gloomy outside again today. So I took a bath, read a little bit. It's actually not even the morning. I said good morning, but it's like afternoon. It's 1.15. It is just like a super chill day. It's just going to be an editing day again. Some good news is this morning, the painter guy came and ended up just finishing up the whole entire wall for us and then fixing those little spots here on the ceiling that we messed up he just finished it for us i was so thankful so we're kind of letting that dry a little bit and our bed is still like forward this is all we had to work with in terms of space so yeah i'm really proud of the way that it came out i feel like he did an amazing job i feel like i want to say that i helped a little bit and i guess i did in terms of the first coat but yeah uh we are not professional painters we have pretty much cleared that up. I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here because I am just gonna be sitting on my computer editing and in my robe all day, so. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up. Love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys all in a future video. Bye, guys.